Good morning. How y'all doing today? All right. So today we're looking at randomizer script to create dice rolls, which could probably be extrapolated and used for other things. As long as we're able to generate a random number and put it into a variable, that random number could be used to trigger several different uh, events or triggers. So anyway, what we're looking at here first is our dice roller um, in this one here. So we have a command break down whatever the value of this is going to go into the variable 12 and we just send a text showing the uh, the results or the value of variable 12 this is the command for that uh, we're going to look at this in a bigger command as well so we can see it easier okay so math.random generates a random number between 0 and 1 exclusive now I didn't fully understand that so I got clarification and we'll come down here and take a look we're going to use this as if we were doing a 20 sided die in this case so what we're going to do is say maths.render random number generates the number one, which can't be used. Uh, no, let's not do that. Secure. Here's what we're looking for. So <clears throat> let's say math.random generates a random number. So the random number it generates to be anywhere between zero and 0 0.999999. It cannot hit one. It's because one's an exclusive number, which we found out uh, during our uh, our studies on this. So what will happen then, if we take it back and look at this this variable here, so this will be our random anywhere 0, 2.999. In this case here, we're going to get the number 0.398523. We times that by 20, which is going to give us 7.97, which rounds down to 7. We add the 1, or 8. It's pretty simplistic. At first, you know, it's a little more complicated. And I said, well, what if we roll the one? And then that's where I found out where you cannot get the one because one is exclusive, which it'll never actually generate that number. So what we we'll do, we'll take a look at uh, this, this code. I believe I have it's currently set for 20. Roll the dice. Yes. We got a two. That's a horrible roll. <laughs> roll the dice. 16 bit better bit better all right but as you see it'll it'll just generate through through them at first i wanted to make sure they weren't going to go subsequentially or uh give me uh, values that were errors and i've kind of run through it a few times i've not run into any errors yet only digits between 1 and 20. easy enough all right so we're going to end here but thanks for watching, guys. That's a very basic script. Uh, you can find it all on my Discord there. I try to put all the code snippets or anything I learn on there. I, I haven't updated it yet, but I'll be doing that after I make this video. Uh, and we're going to be doing another video after this where we'll be looking at uh, getting a larger set of choices. All right. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.